Hi, this is Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist. And the question today is, Teddy, how do I do superscripts and subscripts in Google Docs? I'm going to show you some features that you have that you may not know about. But before I do, hit that subscribe button because I create these videos to help you. Superscripts, that's like where you have a word and you have a small letter at the end of it. And subscripts is where you have a word and you have a small letter to, at the lower part below it. So let me show you how to do that. If I want to put a superscript or a letter, then let's put an R here. I'm going to highlight the R or select it. And then I'm going to go to Format, Text, Superscript. And there's my R. Now, and by the way, I can make that R smaller too. I can do a negative here and make it as small as I want to make it. By default, it's going to come in at the, you know, roughly at the same size, but superscript for whatever you start with. But you can highlight it and you can make it smaller or bigger. It's still going to sit up top there uh, than what it was by default. Now, subscripts, same thing. Let's put a subscript one. Put it in there, select it or highlight it. Go to format, text, subscript. And there it is there. And again, it's going to be the same font size, but it's going to be down lower. And again, I can make it smaller or I make it bigger, however I want, once I put it in place. Okay, let's show another one. Let's go, oh my gosh, this is wrong. So let's do strikeout, highlight it or select it. And then once I select it, do format, text, strike through. And I can get strike through on it. And then just so for giggles, for basic, simple formatting, we can do things like bold, underscore, and we can do uh, italics. And all of that is pretty easy to do. You highlight it and you do a command or control B and an underscore, you highlight it and do a con command or control U and italics, you highlight that and you do a command or control I. And again, all of that is under format, text, bold, italic, and underline. And furthermore, I can do even more. I can type over here, let's get rid of the italics. I can type a word here and I say, this is the story I want to tell you. Now if I highlight that, look what other options I have under format and text, and I have capitalization, I can make it all uppercase. If I want to, while it's highlighted, go to format, text, go to capitalization, make it all lowercase. And then furthermore, Go back to where it needs to be, format, text, capitalization, and go back to title case, and I can make it every letter um, of every first letter of the word uppercase. And again, if I don't like any of that, watch this. Highlight it, watch this. Control or Command Z, back up, back up, back up, back up to where I started in the beginning. So all of this uh, formatting is all up under format, text, and so it's really easy to do and it helps your Google Docs look better and be more useful to the reader. I'm Teddy Burris, your Google Workspace and Gmail strategist, trainer, and coach. If you like these types of little videos, please do me a favor, hit the subscribe button.